Absolutely. You mentioned warmed over atheism. It made me think about your warmed over Swiss and onion cheeseburger recipe that mm, you gave. That la- sounds amazing. <laughs> Last time you came on my show, and I believe you responded to a super chat that was asking you for a burger recipe and it generated huge memes on the internet people even bringing these as super chat in mainstream uh, youtubers uh, you can you can see mainstream youtubers oh, wow. read the super wow. chat and they're like i like burgers with onions and cheese <laughs> and they don't know it's from richard spencer <laughs> well, so what I are mean, your thoughts i don't even know what to say about this one um uh, uh, yeah, I, I I think it was on your show where someone asked me super, and I don't know if it was a setup or it was just a genuine uh, uh, question. But um, I hate to break the news to you. I've I've already broken news here with this rumor that I passed along. But you know, I hate to break the news to you guys, but uh, I'm a bit of a snob. Yeah, uh, um, you know, shocking revelation here. Uh, but yeah, look, I'm 41 years old. I like nicer things. I, I'm if I'm going to eat a hamburger, I'm going to go buy a pretty, <laughs> go get a pretty nice one. I mean, sorry guys, I know this is, but of all my cosmopolitan taste, uh, my my uh, love of uh, smoked on or caramelized onions and smoked mushrooms might be one of my uh, lesser <laughs> ones. But yeah, I I think it was it was bizarre because I I saw this and I was just kind of like, yeah, w- whatever. I mean, this is like a if anything, a kind of silly humanizing aside uh you know it it didn't bother me at all but they were obsessed with it and they they seem to this is the gripers they they seem to be putting forth like eating at mcdonald's as the real american you know alternative uh to these you know foppish snobs like uh richard spencer i mean if if this is what you got um wow kind of feel sorry for you guys yeah it, the, the source the source of it may be the that you offer a contrast to nick frontes who constantly eats big macs and reminds on his show that he's he's about to eat a big mac maybe the crowd was not exposed to the burgers of the 90s maybe me and richard are just too old <laughs> We're too old for the direction of the world, and we live maybe in a post-mushroom world. I don't know. Now, in this we whole do. reposition, it's very sad. we do. <laughs> Fukuyama prophesized this, you know, post-onion, uh, um, you know, America that we are now experiencing. Yeah. The end. Of uh, yeah, burgers. I mean, look, I, I don't, I don't know what to say. I mean, uh, other than um, grow up. I mean, y- you know, go. <laughs> I don't know. I don't know what to say beyond that. Uh, you should be eating healthily, and you only live once. And we're on this short. We're on this planet for a short time. Uh, go indulge in a, a a nice meal with a friend or family member, or you know, cute girlfriend, and you know, enjoy life. I, I just, I just don't know. I, I mean, I just find this kind of thing so baffling. I, I just, it's like. This is what resonates with you as an anti Spencer meme. This, uh, I, I just, yeah, absolutely baffled by it. All right, we'll be the, we'll be doing a degustation here on the show. Uh, maybe the twenty fourth, twenty fifth. Me and Mama JF, we will have eight or ten French meals. We will be mm. tasting it all. It's going to be high level cooking. Uh, on this old the greatest meal that I had this past year uh, was absolutely raw um it it was at this uh great place in chicago that um my uh, girlfriend and i went to and i I guess i won't mention it because i don't want to be kicked out (laughs) or something uh but it's a cool place what was the meal uh cool place wooden panels dark lightning uh lighting um we had uh some uh good manhattans and then we had raw oysters uh as a as a starter and uh and then this amazing beef tartare so yeah knicker nation will love this it is a big slab of raw meat and uh absolutely bloody and uh with some selected cheese on top and a cracked egg uh in it so uh i my stomach was full of raw oysters raw eggs and raw beef and I Absolutely. Was really happy. So there you the go. Beef that was the greatest with, meal I've had this year. 
the yellow of the <laughs> egg still in its little yellow pouch that you can uh, exactly. you can pierce it and it gives a sauce. When you can afford this, gripers, come back to us. <laughs> 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 I, I enjoy too much attacking these gripers. It's bad for me. I have to stop. Um, yeah, on the, the whole I was at Burger King and I kept asking for the beef tartare and they were just looking at me funny. I don't know if they knew who I was or, or something. Please help me out. 